Hey, my name is T. Kyle, and I am a digital producer for Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen. And I was an RA in Coed Hall and at Kaufman Hall. I think the biggest skill that I learned as an RA that helped me in my professional career is public speaking. You are constantly having floor meetings and you have to talk to people and you have to be in front of people and you have to do training and all of these different things and it really helps you get comfortable over the years with interviewing and being a person in the office and managing people and that's definitely the biggest thing. Also, writing reports and being very detailed helps with emails. People love a detailed email, especially if you work in ad sales. So detail, all that stuff has really helped. Okay, so if you are watching this and you're thinking about becoming an RA, but you're too nervous because you don't know if you're gonna be able to juggle your social life with school and all your projects and papers with being an RA, do not worry, trust me when I tell you it is totally possible. I was an art and design student. Now, it's been a while since I graduated in 2010 and I don't know if things have changed or whatnot, but we had a lot of classes, sometimes nine or 10 a semester just to be able to keep up and graduate on time. Not only did I juggle that and do pretty well, I did pretty decent, like B's and A's. I juggled school and I was an RA and I was in student life and I was a part-time lifeguard my sophomore and junior year. And I survived, I'm here, I'm doing good. Um, I did it all. And to be completely honest with you, being an RA and being on duty and having to stay in the dorm and be on call, it actually is the perfect time to get all of your work done. Granted, sometimes being on duty is gonna be a little busy. It happens, things pop up, but sometimes it's really super quiet and you can just spend the entire night doing all of your assignments. And back to what I was saying before about what are some skills that being an RA trains you to be really good at, time management, having everything, being able to plan things out, set times, plan your day, plan your meetings. Get ready because when you're an adult, you gotta schedule time with friends, you gotta schedule trips, like it just, <laughs> things get even crazier when you're in the real world. So being an RA is gonna help train you ahead of time. Because of the shared experience and all of the time that you guys are gonna spend with your fellow RAs, you're really gonna connect with people in a way that's kind of hard at FIT. Everyone's so busy, everyone has so many classes, and there's so many students that don't live on campus. And so being on campus and sharing that experience with people is gonna help you make friends and make community. And there's so many of my residents that I was an RA for that I still keep in touch with. And I just went to the Jonas Brothers concert with one of my friends that I was an RA with like a few weeks ago. Do they still do RA training? I don't know if they, I mean, I'm sure they have to, obviously, duh. But that, oh my God, that was so fun. Like coming back from the summer and going to RA training week and seeing everyone was so much fun. I loved making my floor meeting signs and decorating my big gigantic poster boards and doing my themes every single week and getting together with everyone and crafting and designing stuff and uh, you know I'm older now but those are the days they really were I loved it I have been in New York for over 13 years now and some of my favorite memories that I have here are from my time as an RA. 
dead serious. I love my job. I have an amazing job. I get to see celebrities every single day. It's amazing. I love my career. But those times as an RA with the friends that I made that I still keep in touch with today were some of the best years ever here in New York. Highly recommend. Do it. Stop this video right now, close out on Instagram, click around, whatever it is, send in an email, go apply, do it, try it out. I'm telling you, you will love it. You'll have so much fun. And I don't know, I wish I, I mean, I wish I could be 21 again. Don't we all? But it is worth it.